Hi there, good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. So in this video, we are going to talk about Microsoft Copilot, or rather Microsoft 365 Copilot. So before we get started, guys, I'm going to ask you kindly to get a piece of paper. A pen, a pencil would do as long as you can take down notes. If you want to do it via your uh, desktop, laptop, or tablet, or any devices out there, just pull up your handy dandy notepad right here. If you don't have notepad, I think they should be called notes or sticky notes on your end. Okay, if you can find the notepad, just search it on the search bar on the lower left. Click enter and then this is how it should look like. Just put anything here, take down notes, anything as long as you can follow through. Especially the important notices on Microsoft 365. Okay, let's get started. Let me just remove this one. So, on um, what is Microsoft 365? So, I found upon my research here before I get started on the exact Microsoft 365, I'm going to let you know what to expect. So, technically, Microsoft 365 Copilot, by the name itself, Copilot is going to be your partner. Your partner in working for all of those um, corporate world workers out there, same as me. We always use Excel, right? Excel, PowerPoint, uh, Microsoft Word, even Outlook. Outlook is better than Gmail regarding the workspace environment. So imagine Copilot being your friend, your AI friend, or rather ChatGPT, inclined or integrated with those offices, words, um, Excel, and so on and so forth. So again, um, today we are bringing the power of next generation AI to work, introducing Microsoft 365 Copilot. Your Copilot for work, and it combines the power of large amount, or rather large language models, or LLMS, with your data in Microsoft Graph and the Microsoft 365 apps to turn your words into the most powerful productivity tool on the planet. Yes, they claim that they're going to be the most powerful on the planet. So, they're going to work or transform in three ways. First of all, is Unleash Creativity. With Microsoft in Word, you can jump, start a creative process you never start with a blank slate again. Technically, imagine this one. Let me just open my Word right here and just we're at for load. Actually, I don't have Microsoft 365 yet, and I'm, I'm going to tell you why I don't have it yet later on. So imagine opening a blank document. With this one, if you have Microsoft Copilot, they're going to ask you what do you want to do with Word, what's your idea of project right now. And technically, you just need to enter, make me a, let's just say application letter for a managerial position. And then Copilot will give you templates, pre-typed documents with the exact tile that you're looking for, okay? So that's Microsoft Copilot within Microsoft Word. Again, unlock productivity is the second one. We all want to focus on the 20% of our work that really matters, but 80% exactly. 80% of our time is consumed with busy work that bugs us down. So Copilot lightens the load from summarizing long email threads to quickly interrupting suggested replies. Imagine Copilot working with Outlook. You don't have to think. You don't have to think what to reply, how being, how to be professional, how to be professional on your um, worker co-workers regarding uh, replying to their email. Okay. Now, lastly, I think this is gonna be the last uh, thing that Copilot helps us. It's gonna be up level skills. Copilot makes you better at what you're good and lets you work easily or quickly master what you get to learn. The average person uses only a handful of commands, such as animate or slide. They're talking about PowerPoint here. Or insert a table. They're talking about Excel here. From 1,000 available across 365 Microsoft. Now, imagine Microsoft Copilot will give you all of the benefits with this one. I can't really um, scale or I can't really measure how uh, evolve or how better your emails, your Word, your projects, your PowerPoint presentations, your Excel files would look with this AI system. Now, I'm gonna, just going to uh, let you guys know about this one. I've stumbled across, uh, I think this is going to be a query regarding Microsoft 365. And it says here, she, she, she or she has a Microsoft 365 account. However, he cannot see Microsoft 365 yet. Or rather, to be specific, he cannot see or she cannot see Copilot yet. So that means that you might not be able to see functionally because you're Microsoft 65 is it personally enrolled in the Loop Preview Program. Again, Microsoft is progressively distributing Loop to more users and businesses who might eventually get access. Okay? I'm going to talk about Loop later on. Anyway, I just want to let you know, guys, that Microsoft 65 doesn't really have it rolled out to the public yet regarding Copilot. So, you might need to wait for a few 
uh, I think days or weeks to have it available on your end and you should buy it. It's not for free. And then regarding loop, I'm going to talk to you about loop. Okay. So this is going to be loop. It's one of the newest application of Microsoft 365 right now. And you can access it to this website. And imagine having everything together. It's just like Discord. However, Discord with Microsoft offices. For example, let me just create a new task right here. Okay. Now, what will I use this task for? So I can use it for team decision, project planning, meeting notes, but idea brainstorm, project wiki, and so on and so forth. Let me just try this one, project brief, okay? Use this template. And with this one, I can also update the cover photo. I can also update this um, logo, okay? I can also edit this title, brief project, okay? Use this template to kick off a new project. Overview, I can edit everything here. Imagine what you can do with this um, loop application, okay? Now it's in members, you can input everything. And by the way, you can add anyone. Imagine this brief project right here. You can share this page link, you can share loop component and add to your workspace. If I click on this one and get that one right there. Imagine having people on this specific project. It's just much like of a Discord server. And then anyone can edit here, you can really work here. Are, are you guys familiar with Asana? Imagine Asana and Discord um, combine and then they have loop. That is how loop works. They can edit here, you can really do a project virtually without needing to go to the office, okay? Let me just check my recording right here to make sure everything's good. Sometimes it doesn't record properly. Anyway, with this one, you can also use PowerPoint for your copilot. Now regarding PowerPoint Copilot, if you open the PowerPoint app, this is only available for Microsoft 365, in which case I don't have it yet. And as you can see, there isn't Copilot on my system. However, if you have Copilot on your Microsoft 365, here is where you should find it. It should be over here on the right hand corner of your screen. And then just type anything you want here. And Microsoft 365 will give you preview or pre-built presentations that you can edit from scratch or edit it from there and then finish it along the way. Let me just give you a preview on what to expect. I get to have 365 Copilot right here and then how to download it. Okay. Also, I have Microsoft 365 here. However, I didn't avail it yet. So I suggest you download this application so you can avail the Microsoft 365 regarding the price plans. Okay. So by the way, these are the price plans. For Business Basic, it's going to be $30 user per month, wherein you can pay in annually, which is auto renew. So however, I think this is the price isn't um, shown to the public yet for how much per year. They're only for one month, and there is a free trial for one month, by the way, guys. So actually, the difference of each of the premium standard basic is just going to be a few things, okay? So this is going to be the per year and um, comparison for each of the axes. And by the way, for the basic, I think it's going to be Word, Excel, PowerPoint, and Outlook up to Exchange. Now for standard business, you can have publisher access or even for premium business, you can have Azure. Anyway, for me guys, if you can ask me properly or just going to ask me personally, this $3 per month is good enough for you. It has Word, Excel, PowerPoint. Now, look, those are the basic things we need regarding offices or co corporate work offices. Now, let me show you guys what to expect or where to buy it. So, you can just install this application. It's an overall Microsoft 365. You can get it on the App Store for Microsoft or Microsoft Store. Now, you can rather click on this one, buy Microsoft 365, and even launch the offices right here from Word, Excel, PowerPoint, Outlook, OneDrive, Teams, OneNote, okay? And with this one, this is where you should launch this specific office, right? For example, I click on Word right here. Now, since I already have Word pre-installed on my PC, it will just open my pre-installed application without the Copilot subscription. Because technically, I don't have it just yet. I'm just still planning to buy it in the near future if I really need it. Anyway, this is again, um, to find the Copilot in here, it's going to be displayed on this section right here, the right section of your screen. Just type whatever you want here. Imagine talking to ChatGPT, wherein ChatGPT helps you 
build a Word document. Okay? And that's it. That is Microsoft Copilot for you guys. I hope you enjoy it and I hope you try it out. It's one of the best features right now since ChatGPT came out. AI system has been trending. AI, AI has been a boom recently, right? So anyway, thank you so much for watching. Please hit the like button, subscribe, and I'll catch you on the next one.